just got off the phone with the girl who loves you too Said you're working on yourself, is she helping with that too? You gave her the time of day You told her that you would stay You made me feel the same way What goes around comes around, that's what I always say what up though what's up with all of my beautiful and my handsome scorpios hope all of you guys have been doing well scorpio i've been on the go i've been kind of busy or whatnot so i know i haven't been posting as consistently as i've been wanting to but y'all bear with me because this week gonna be crazy too okay so you guys just bear with me i'm gonna try to get y'all two out right quick if i don't i'll get this one and then i'll get back to you guys a little later on this evening because i gotta run out of town right quick okay so Let's get into this horoscope. This is going to be your horoscope for April the 29th through May the 3rd. Okay, so April the 29th through May the 3rd. So we're going to see what messages Spirit has for you guys. If anything resonates, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and comment. If you are interested in a personal, my information, you guys, will be in the description box below. I am running a special on those readings as well. And as I mentioned, all the information will be in the description box, okay? So let's get into it. Scorpio horoscope, April the 29th through May the 3rd. So we have lots of sevens. We got the number 27 and the number 17, okay? So I feel like this week, we, you, you will be doing a lot of expressing. Your mind is wide open. So your mind could have been clouded. Your thoughts could have been clouded. Your visions could have been clouded in the past. But now your mind is open and free. You are, to, you are tolerant and you're compassionate toward all walks of life. You value freedom of expression and you want to improve the conditions of people, whether in your community, your country, or in the world at large. So I feel like something that you're going to be doing this week is going to allow you to be able to express yourself a little bit more, okay? This expressing will possibly help you to connect with other people. Maybe you're going to be working with people within your community or just finding ways in which you can make the world a better place here, okay? We also have the number 17, so I feel like you'll be independently doing some things this week as well, okay? Something could transpire this week that's going to make you become more independent, and it has to do with your work, okay? The quality of work you can produce when you're going at it alone is almost unbelievable, okay? So I feel like some of you are going to be put in a position this week to where you're independently going to be able to focus just on your goals and be able to focus on your work, okay? So this means in the past, you have to do a lot of multitasking. You have to try to work. You have to try to do this. You have to try to do that, okay? But I feel like this week, something about you being in hermit mode and just being able to just like go with it nonstop, you know, without a lot of distractions and interruptions. Some of you are very ambitious, but it's like you work better when you have that time alone. You know, some of you are like me, like I have to have, and it doesn't even have to be a long time. I just need that peace and quiet so that I can focus and I can really work. Okay. So I feel like efficiency, focus and skill is going to be very important to you guys because you're going to be doing something to where you're able to work by yourself or you're going to be in a, in a zone, you know, where you're being able to get quality work done alone. Okay. So let's pull a little bit more. What does Scorpio need to know April the 29th through May the 3rd? If anything resonates for you guys so far, don't forget to like this video. All right. April the 29th through May the 3rd. What does Scorpio need to know, Holy Spirit? Okay, factory. Okay, so some of you can work in a factory or you work in the like production or something like that, maybe in the manufacturing company or you work on some type of assembly line so something could happen at a job or or maybe you guys are going to be maybe put in a position to where maybe you're going to have some type of leadership role or something so someone around you if you don't work at a factory someone around you can maybe do factory work here and we also have okay government building okay so this talks about public services so some of you may be receiving or maybe you receive government assistance here or you could be trying to file paperwork to get some type of government assistance this week. Let's get one more. Messages for Scorpio. April the 29th through May the 3rd. What does Scorpio need to know? 
All right, and we got ship. Okay, for some of you guys, maybe you are going on a boat, on a cruise, some type of sailing vessel, or going on some type of journey or adventure here. That's what's up. I want to get on a boat, Scorpio. Y'all know I'm country. My grandma used to say she wasn't born with wings or fins. Therefore, she ain't flying and she ain't getting on no boat. You know what I'm saying? I, I felt that way for a long time, too. But I'm like, you know, I don't know what I'm missing out on. So I would love to fly one day. I would love to travel by boat, go on a cruise. So someone here could be thinking about, you know, planning a vacation or doing something where you're going to be traveling here. All right. So let's get into the tea leaf here. Let's dig a little deeper, Scorpio. Let's see what's coming towards you guys. April the 29th through May the 3rd. If anything is resonating so far, don't forget to like this video. What is coming towards Scorpio? What do they need to know? April the 29th through May the 3rd, Holy Spirit. What is it that Scorpio needs to know? April 29th through May the 3rd. What is Scorpio need to know okay so we have ram okay so we have a stubborn aggressive person so some of you can be dealing with a stubborn person this could also be someone who can get aggressive you know what i'm saying so this is someone who doesn't who want things to only go their way and this could also be someone who kind of acts aggressively if things don't go their way so some of you can be dealing with a stubborn Against the person, this can be a lover, this can be a family member, friend, co-worker. We, damn, we also got bull. So who are, okay, so some of you are about to be going up against somebody, okay? Some of you, this could be an op. Because we got do not back down from the op, okay? Show strength and fortitude, okay? So some of you could be dealing with someone. And it's like, kind of like got that, you know, I always say that my way or the highway type attitude but this is somebody who you may have to put i'm not gonna say protect yourself but you gonna have to stand up for yourself is the energy that i'm getting here okay because you got this ram and this bull here so this is someone for some of you guys you may have to stand up for yourself this could be someone who tries to i don't want to say like jump down your throat type you know but this is someone who i don't know i just ain't liking them two energies here let's let's pull some more i really feel like you're gonna have to stand in your power and stand up for yourself here, okay? Tell us more, Holy Spirit. And we're going to pull on this. Definitely going to pull on this. What is it that my beautiful and my handsome Scorpios, what do they need to know? I put a 29th through May the 3rd here. All right. What does Scorpio need to know? All right. We have heart. So this talks about love, deep affection, and caring. So there can be some deep affection going on, a love. This is giving me like heart chakra energy. So there can be a lot of love and energy. Maybe you can be feeling deep affection or love towards someone. Or someone could be, you know, showing you that they care. All right? All right, messages for Scorpio, April the 29th through March the 3rd. So we got family sorrow. All right, so this could be someone like experiencing um, like a, I don't want to say a death or just maybe something that's going to be sad for the family here, okay? We also have sunrise. So we have new creative ideas, new adventure, or a fresh start. So I feel like this week you're going to be full of ideas. Remember I said you're going to be expressing yourself more, okay? Maybe you guys been on some type of creative block or experience. Some type of creative block, but it's like the sun, okay? Something's going to make you very happy. And this is going to be like a fresh start for you, okay? So this could be a new job. Maybe you're doing something new or starting some type of new business venture here. All right, let's pull a couple of more. All right, messages for Scorpio. What do they need to know? What does Scorpio need to know? April the 29th through May the 3rd, all right? So we got March. So you can be dealing with a Pisces or an Aries here. We got April, okay? So you can be dealing with or something can happen. Definitely can happen within these next two days, okay? You can be dealing with a Taurus or Aries here. So heavy Aries energy. Messages for my Scorpio. What do I need to know?
messages for my beautiful and my handful Scorpios. I love you, Scorpio. What do they need to know? All right, so we got purse. So make sure you guys, these next few days, are really paying attention to your finances. So you may have to be shilling out some money or spending some money here, but make sure you ain't spending it all, okay? So make sure these next few days that you're really paying attention to your finances. Give me the energy of you having to spend some money or maybe come out of pocket for some things, okay? All right, so let's get a little bit of energy. Let's see what the energy is around this reading, and then I'm going to clarify this ram and this bull here, okay? All right, messages for my beautiful and my handsome Scorpios. What is the energy surrounding them? April the 29th through May the 3rd. What is the energy surrounding Scorpio? April the 29th through May the 3rd here. What is the energy around Scorpio? April the 29th through May the 3rd. All right. Let's get into this energy, Scorpio. What type of energy is surrounding this reading or will be around Scorpio? April the 29th through May the 3rd. Let me do it right here. Okay. Let's get into this energy. What type of energy is going to be around Scorpio? April the 29th through May the 3rd. No type of energy. Okay, let's take this one. All right, I don't know what to say to you. So there's someone in your energy, you guys, who really doesn't know how to talk to you, you know, maybe how to apologize or just what to say in general, you know? This could be disturbing, aggressive person, so versus them, you know, talking to you and using their words this could be someone who acts very stubborn, very aggressive. Maybe this person don't know how to talk to you, you know, but you may have to stand up to this person or they're going to try to, I don't know. It's just giving me the energy of you having to stand up for yourself, okay? Or someone in your energy may be having to do this. What is the energy surrounding Scorpio, April the 29th through May the 3rd? Look at this. I can't make this up, you guys. Someone from your past is returning. So for some of you, someone from your past is returning. This could be an ex. This could be an old co-worker, friend, or a family member here. And this could be someone who just don't know how to talk to you. Like, they maybe they want to speak to you. It's something they want to say, but they just don't know how to talk to you, okay? So let's pull on this. Okay, messages from Scorpio. We've got a couple things to clarify here. So first, we're going to clarify this stubborn, aggressive person, okay? This realm, some of you could be dealing with the Taurus here. All right, tell us about this realm, Holy Spirit. What does Scorpio need to know about this realm? Clarify this, this realm. Who is this stubborn, aggressive person in Scorpio's energy? Messages for my Scorpios. Who is this stubborn, aggressive person in Scorpio's energy? <sighs> three of Wands. Okay, like I said, heavy Aries. You could be seeing three, three, three as well i feel like for some of you this is somebody that you were waiting on you were possibly waiting on i don't know someone here to make a choice or make some type of decision here you was waiting for something or something something or someone to arrive now for some of you remember i said as well you will be expressing yourself and being more creative so this week there could be something that's going to happen, and this is really going to help your business take off. You can be dealing with people all around the world. But whoever this stubborn, aggressive person is, this could be someone that you're like in a long-distance relationship. You can be in different countries, but there is some type of distance. But you've been waiting, you know, on this person. So maybe this is someone who's just too stubborn to make changes or to work on themselves here. Tell us more about this realm, Holy Spirit. Messages for my Scorpio. Tell us more about this stubborn, aggressive person. Some of you, this could be an Aries. Don't have to be. Tell us more about this stubborn, aggressive person. Yeah, this is someone. Yeah, some of you guys have been waiting for this person. Like I said, to make some type of choice, make a decision. Some of you, this could have to maybe do with your business. You've been waiting for the perfect time to make a move. And it's like, this is the time to take some type of leap of faith. I'm reading these two ways. For some of you, I feel like this has to do with business. 
you've been waiting for the perfect time or the opportunity to do something. And it's like you're being encouraged this week to take some type of leap of faith because you're about to be doing something independently here, okay? Now, for others of you, you could be dealing with now, for some of you within work, there could be a stubborn, aggressive person that you've been waiting on. For others of you, I feel like this has to do maybe with love, someone from your past. You are waiting for someone to do something, possibly to take some type of leap of faith towards you to walk into the unknown. Okay, so tell us about do not back down from the op. But this is giving me the energy of, I'm still trying to see what's going on here. Messages for my Scorpios, Holy Spirit. Tell us about this bull. So we got this bull and this ram, and they neither one of them looking too good to me, okay? So tell us about this bull. But we got do not back down from the op. So who is this op? Who is this person that Scorpio don't need to back down? Who needs to show strength and fortitude with? Who is this person, Holy Spirit? Who is this bull? Messages from my Scorpio. Who is this bull in their energy? Someone who ain't got balance. So someone who wants to throw you off balance here. Okay, you can be dealing with the Sag. So we got temperance. Okay. This is someone who is not rest resting, and you're going to have a clash, okay? There's a difference between you and this person, and it may just be too great. So there's going to be some type of difference here, okay? This could be like a disagreement. Tell us more about temperance, Holy Spirit. We're going to get to this, Holy Scorpio. Tell us about temperance. Who is this op? Who is Scorpio not need to back down to? This magician. Because, Scorpio, you're in your power. You're going to have to stand strong in your power. Tell us more. Somebody could be trying to manipulate you. In some shape, form, or fashion here. Tell us more. Damn, these coming out quick. Yep, look at this. Ooh, Scorpio. For some of you, this could be a third party. Because we got this Empress, okay? This Empress is a fake person, okay? This is a fake divine family. This is somebody who wants to be like you. This is a copycat, okay? So some of you have been waiting for someone to take a leap of faith towards you, okay? This is what you've been waiting on. But this person is too damn stubborn. For some of you, they could be are acting aggressively towards you. But you've been waiting on this person to take a leap of faith. But for some of you, they haven't been able to because of this faith divine feminine here, okay? And this is someone that some of you are not going to... Spirit is not wanting you to back down. So this is giving me the energy of this. This could be someone wanting to reach out. Tell us about this Empress Holy Spirit. Because you're manifesting. You're using your personal power to create the things that you want. To create your reality for some of you you call me in love you're about to be meeting the, the love of your life here after possibly dealing with someone who played a lot of games in the past like things are, are coming in for you right and you know what things come in you know the devil stay busy to be trying to make sure those things don't happen but you're really taking the time to manifest the desire like you all have some type of desired outcome that you want for yourself and you're taking the time to do that here tell us about this faith divine family Messages for my Scorpio. So some of you, you may have dealt with this person. Look at that message. You may have dealt with this person from your past. Maybe not. We got Gemini, Libra, Taurus, Sag, Aries, and Aquarius. All right, so tell us about this fake divine film. Look at this. Look at this, y'all. I can't make this up. We got the, we got the moon, y'all. For some of you, this fake divine film, like, they want to expose. They could be wanting to expose your person you guys okay maybe tell you some secrets about this person you know making maybe not wanting you to choose them or trying to keep you from wanting to be with them like this is this is somebody who's trying to sabotage some shit here you hear me let me get to this moon i'm getting here y'all okay this is someone who is operating either shadow self their lower self deception illusion this is someone who's going to try to create some type of illusion in your life okay Secrets. This third party could be trying to expose your person. They could be trying to tell you some secrets, or you know, I feel like they're just trying to do whatever they can in their power to stop a reunion or stop a union from happening here. Let's look, because we got someone from your past, because somebody from your past is wanting to return to you, and this is why this fake divine film is trying to step in and intercept this shit, okay? They're trying, they trying to block their shots, you guys, okay? Look at this. Let's pull on this. Someone from your past is returning. Tell us about this. 
messages for my beautiful and my handsome Scorpios. I love you, Scorpio. Also, some of you with this, because I don't know why they had me look at this purse, okay? Maybe some of you are having to pay, you know, pay people for helping you do something here, but still make sure you pay attention to your finances here, okay? All right, tell us about this person from Scorpio Cash. Who is returning? Who is this person from Scorpio Cash that's returning? Holy Spirit. Look at this. Somebody who want to work with you for some of this. Some of you, this could be a Capricorn. For some of you, maybe in the past, you know, you were trying to collaborate and work with people. You were trying to get them on board with some type of idea or something here that you were trying to, like some type of vision that you had for yourself and you were trying to, you know, work with people, collaborate with them, help, you know, get assistance, but you could have been turned down in the past. But I feel like someone here is going to notice your gift. Someone this week is going to see something very special within you. And they're going to want to work with you guys, okay? Also, this person returning from your past, this is someone who wants to give you an equal give and take. So this could have been a one-sided connection or relationship or marriage or whatever in the past. But this is someone here now who wants to put in the same amount of effort, okay? But I feel like for a lot of you, something this, work has to, something this week has to do with work. You're going to be recognized for your hard work. People are going to start to notice your gifts, okay? Or someone could be interested in investing in you scorpio okay all right you guys so let's go to the answer in time now we, we ain't gonna go there we're gonna go to the who did because let's see who this let's get a description of this person from your past who is wanting to return and then we're going to see who this reading is about okay if anything has resonated for you guys don't forget to like share subscribe comment let your girl blue flame know what's going on and if you are interested in a reading remember I am running a special, and all the information will be in the description box below. All right, Scorpio. So let's get a description of your person here. Because somebody from your past wants to return, but this third party is going to try their best to make sure that shit don't happen. And for some of you, you're going to have to stand up for yourself. You're going to have to check this third party is what I'm getting. Because it's going to be somebody that's going to be trying to come at you with some little rah-rah type shit and tell them, Scorpio, we don't do all that, okay? So some of you, you may be checking. A third party about your past person here, okay? All right, tell us more. Who is this reading about for Scorpio? All right, we got age 2025. 20, Someone who has green eyes. Who is this reading about for my beautiful and my handsome Scorpio? I was serious. Who is this reading about? All right, we got brown, caramel complexion, someone who's not dark, not too light, someone who wears the lashes, and let's get one more. All right, we got age 70 to 75, okay? So let's get the signs here. We had Aquarius, Aries, Capricorn, Sag, Libra, Taurus, and Gemini. So let's see who this reading is about. All right, so we got Heavy Sash, Virgo, Gemini. We got Capricorn, Scorpio, Gemini, Virgo. Damn, heavy, heavy, heavy Cancer energy and Pisces. All right, you guys, I love you. And until next time, stay blessed.